It's a beautiful day here in Dar es Salaam. And yo guys, I'm not living anytime soon. It's my third day here and I'm loving it. Yes, my host said today she's going to take me around town. We are going to go to the suburb of um, Dar es Salaam into a different city. It's called Baga Moyo. I know you've seen it from the title, but please don't forget to hit the subscribe button if it's your first time. And because I don't know there, she is going to say much about it and take us there to see what we have. She's going to be the chauffeur. Hey. So I'm going to bring her on the show, but she surprised me. I don't know where she got this shirt from, but let's bring her on the show and see who she is. So, <laughs> yo. <laughs> so this is my host. Yo. She's so beautiful, guys. She's so don't write anything in the comment section. I beg. I beg. Nothing. Okay. So she is um, Yvonne. Yeah. Yvonne. Um, thank you so much for having me for three days, four days, five days, and beyond. She's going to take care of me forever. She has been taking good care of me. I really appreciate You're that. You're welcome. Yes. So Yvonne says she's taking us to Bagamoyo. What's in Bagamoyo? Okay. Karibu sana, Tanzania. Karibu As sana. Santa sana. Fine. I'll yeah, take right. you to Bagamoyo. Bagamoyo is a very beautiful island, mm -hmm. actually. Uh, there is uh, lots of memorial. Actually, okay. there was slave trade down there mm. some years ago. All right. uh, by the way, I, I can't speak much because mm. we are going to see it. So I would love you. I would love you to see okay. everything, the All beaches, right. the right. and everything. Uh, so guys, thank you so much for staying tuned. Just come with us. It's going to be a road trip. Sure. And um, it's how many hours? I think they like one, one hour, maybe one and a half. If okay. There is Traffic is yeah. alright. So yeah. yes, we are going to take approximately one and a half hours or two hours to get there. It's a road trip. We are going to do everything. Every little thing that we are going to see on the road, we are going to bring it to you. So yeah. stay tuned. Come with us. Let's go! <laughs> So guys, if you can hear her, so this is from a local person. We just stopped by to get this um, crema. It's like an ice cream toffee and it's so nice. I tried it one time and I loved it. So anytime I'm out, I try to get one. Yes, and it's from a big businessman that has seen, um, um, I'm trying to make it affordable for everyone to try it. Guess the price. We bought four for less than $1. And in my currency, it's going to be one city for each. So four cities, which is even less than one dollar. That's amazing, guys. So um, whenever you're in Tanzania, please try and get one of this ice cream because it's made in Tanzania and I know you will love it too. So they have different flavors and we got um, the crema, um, the milk flavor. Yes, is it? Um, yes, it's 500 shillings. Yes, so please try and get one for yourself when you're here. Cheese! That's a full advertisement for the company. And the King Kong Beach is right in front of us. So guys, this is um, one historic building. German. Uh, the German old oak. Okay, this is the video, the picture I saw. You see that building there? We're going to go there. And look at the ocean right there. It's so beautiful. King Kong Beach Park. So why are we going to the park? Okay. We are going to the porch this time. So how are you feeling about that? <laughs> Wow, I'm also excited though I've been here before. Okay. But I'm also excited to be with you to show you around the Thank beautiful you. Bagamoyo. Thank you. Asante, Asante Sana. Karibu yes, Sana, so, Tanzania. Yes, so, so we are going to, like, this is an old town. Yeah. It looks, old town. yes. Built in 19th. Yeah. No, 18th. 18th. Yes. <laughs> So yes, yes, it looks yeah, it looks amazing here. I love the fact that they've not destroyed all these buildings. Yes. They've not destroyed all these buildings and they've kept it for all this while and um for us to come and see some. Yes, so let's just go and see what they have there. Yo, it's so refreshing. It's so beautiful out here. That's a, like I can't wait. I can't wait to show you. Mm. We are lost. I think we are lost. We don't know where to park. This side, we are right. Yeah. There are cars yeah. there, but the, there's but no gate. Like yeah. Yes. Bye. 
house. He was going too fast. Is he coming? No, he's coming. Are they coming? Hey, in the beach. Beach night, never here. Punjab, 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 so we're asking for where to park and then he's been so nice to us he showed us yeah so if you want to go to the beach you have to go and park at the beach you don't have to park far from the beach that's what he said i guess i'm right yes yes good so my swahili is getting better and better every single day so let's just give me one more week and then i can speak swahili fluently <laughs> oh my god so let's just go and see what they have there i love the old buildings here yes let's go and see it from the sky and from the beach side. See how good mm. people are. Eh? Don't join us. That's him right there. <laughs> Pambo VP. Where is she? Oh, Poa. So, this is it. He's helping us to see where we can park. Oh, I'm happy. I'm happy to Nyoche. be here. Mm. Yeah, keep straight. Keep straight. <laughs> <laughs> and 10 left. Yes. He's saying 10 left, you don't understand Swahili. Yeah, understand. 10 left, 10 left. <laughs> Yo, my Swahili is so good, guys. Yes, just in three days, I'm speaking Swahili already. I can see some fresh fish right here. Okay. Here, open up a cabin. Welcome to the beautiful city of Bagamoyo. It's a coastal area and it's so amazing right here. They got some old buildings here. I think it was built by the Germans and also an ocean here. I can see the ferry. I can see this beautiful place. And my host here is going to show me around. I hope we can see something nice and bring something to you. Guys, without much I do, let's just go to the beach side first and then from there we'll go to those old buildings in Bagamoyo. Come with me. Let's go. Guys, so I had a chance to talk to the people there yeah. right behind me and you see they are building a boat, a big boat right behind me. So, yeah, I, I got a chance to ask them about how the boat is done and how many months it takes them to finish and also how much it costs and the labor they need and i was told they need 10 people it takes four months to finish and um the type of wood they use is neem and also um it costs fifty thousand dollars to finish the whole boat building this boat you need this unique device to get the accurate measurements and i didn't know the name they kept saying the name in swahili which i didn't know so if you know the name of this unique device to get accurate measurements of the boats please put it in the comment section so that i can also know the name in english this is amazing i've never seen something like this before if you have please help me and put the name in the comment section also they need 10 people to finish building the boat in four months which is so amazing And we have a friend here who is helping us out too. So they have some kind of unique boats here, canoes, which I've never seen before. So we just take a look at these ones. And if you should look behind me, you can see these old buildings down there. And I, I learned that it's um, the very first hotel that came to Bagamoyo. Ah, it looks so good from here yes so yeah that's also that um what what are we going to see now the cemetery or oh, there's maasai 